Well, it's nearly been two months since I've shown you Queen Sisa, the Kalamurmix Albertsi colony, so there's something special I want to show you guys. Lots been happening, let's get into it. So, a quick little look around the outworld here. We can see there are plenty of workers foraging out here. Now, it's starting to look a little bit cramped, what do you think? I like to give them a little bit of room to move and they've had this small outworld for quite some time as well. But I do love the outworld, it's just really nice. It's a good setup for them, there's plenty of room to move and they've got everything they need in there. What do you guys think? This is the Empire of Ants uh, outworld. But if we have a look inside their nest, they're growing really rapidly. They've started to really take off and there's plenty of brood and this is with a fair few workers in the outworld and we're still don't have a lot of room left in this nest. So what I've decided to do is upgrade them. And I'm going to show you a little bit of what I'm going to be doing there with the upgrade. It's pretty cool. So let's have a quick little look around. Uh, just a bit of a macro shot on these guys. Now again, the one thing I do like about these, they're really hairy ant. The little uh, hairs on the back of their legs and segments. It's really quite cool. Nice jet black colour. And these are the ones that pulse. They do that pulsing when they get excited, which is which is really funny to watch. Here we have the queen, Queen Sisa, which means pulse in Latin. And here's one just cleaning itself. It's a really nice species of ant and uh, fairly common out there as well. But not a lot of people keep this particular species, so I'm glad that I can share this one with you guys. Now the cocoons and that are ready to hatch. We've probably got another at least half a dozen workers on the way very soon. And there's plenty of brood to come as well, which is fantastic. Beautiful colonies. It's summer here, or the end of summer. Now just coming into autumn, and they're all expanding. So I got this little custom style of acrylic nest, and I'm going to move them into it. Now, it's not particularly that much bigger than what they're exact in at the moment. As you can see there, it's not huge in size, but there is actually plenty more room in there. And it's got that hydration sponge there on the right, which is good. So I'm going to try and do a little bit of a transfer of these guys over into this acrylic nest. Now transferring is always tricky. Let's see how I go. First thing I do is I just unplug that tubing from the outworld and I stuff cotton in either end. That makes the divider. Now we've got some in the outworld but that's fine because we're going to be connecting it back up to that. Now this is a really tricky stage because you can uh, get the ants escaping. So what I've done here is I've just connected up the next, um, a new acrylic nest, and hopefully they'll be able to move over. So I've just kept it in the dark there, and they moved over quite quickly. Look at how active they are there in that outworld as well. So they're into this new acrylic nest, and look at them. Do you reckon they look pretty happy? Let's have a little bit of a closer look in here and see what sort of room they have inside this new nest, which I'm sure they're very excited about. Um, they'll fill that up very nicely. So the queen is doing well. She didn't take long to transfer. Within about an hour, they had transferred over completely, which was a really nice sign. And busy cleaning themselves, feeding each other, so they look pretty happy. And it's nice that um, they feel comfortable enough to move that fast. Still plenty of room in the outworld there, and I'll give them a nice sweet treat and maybe a mealworm just to uh, reward them. For a great transfer over and it can be really tricky doing this but it's gone well and I just want to thank my patreons making these videos is not possible without their support so thanks to happy ant UK medical carcass 9 and William base and the other patreons as well thank you so much for the support if you would like to support the channel head over to patreon patreon.com forward slash novo ants and you can uh, choose from the different levels and the different perks that come along with those different levels as well so thank you very much i hope you've enjoyed the video remember to hit that subscribe button and if you'd like to subscribe to the channel the button's there on the left there also we have a video recommended for you by youtube and then at the bottom one that i've picked for you as well that you might enjoy so head over watch those videos and thank you and remember happy ant keeping